A lawyer for serial bus thief Darius McCollum is steering him toward trial in order to cash in on a movie deal about the Brooklyn Mont's joyrides, prosecutors charged Wednesday. We have records that she will get a benefit in the end, Assistant District Attorney Janet Gleason said about lawyer Sally Butler. Butler signed a contract in 2016 with Hollywood executives for a deal that has Oscar-winning actress Julia Roberts slated to portray her in a movie about McCollum called Trained Man. Your Honor, I'd like for you to look at the contract, to examine it in respect with the date they were signed and when the talks of a movie deal came around, Gleason said prior to the start of jury selection. Butler, who was chosen by a judge in 2012 to defend McCollum after he was first charged with stealing a trailways bus in Queens, vehemently denied the accusations. I've advocated for him the best that I can all these years, Butler said with a shaky voice. McCollum, 52, also has a contract with the producers, although it's unclear which actor might play his part. The film has been on a hiatus for unknown reasons. McCollum is facing trial for taking an empty Greyhound bus for a joyride in November 2015. Jury selection for that trial was put on hold after Gleason questioned Butler's motives. McCollum has turned down various plea offers that would have included sentences of between 312 to 15 years in prison. The transit buff is seeking a plea bargain that wouldn't throw him behind bars without treatment for his Asperger syndrome and autism. A previous offer included a condition that he would receive psychiatric treatment pending a medical evaluation, but Justice Ruth Schellingford rejected it, saying it was not legal. That offer couldn't have been conveyed because the court doesn't think it can be done, Schellingford said. Because McCollum has twice been convicted of felonies in connection to stealing buses and trains, he faces a possible life sentence if convicted of a felony at trial. I made several attempts for the three 12 to 7 years, Gleason said. She then refused, which coincides with the time frame of the documentary and movie deal coming out. Gleason requested that another attorney with no involvement in the pending movie advise May Collum about his plea negotiations in order to avoid possible appeal challenges. I'm comfortable with my attorney, they